In an unprecedented battery earthquake, CATL has announced their groundbreaking condensed battery cells, boasting an incredible energy density of over 500 watt-hours per kilogram. This new battery technology, significantly surpassing the energy density of current batteries, promises to double the range of most electric vehicles. With this leap, KTL's new battery outshines the standard energy density of Tesla's batteries. So, what do we need to know about these new batteries? How powerful are they really? And we must ask, could this be the first mass-produced solid-state battery, and how will Tesla incorporate them? Let's dive into these questions and more in today's video. 1. What exactly is KTL's condensed battery? KTL has unveiled its latest innovation, the condensed matter battery, at Auto Shanghai, marking a significant leap in battery technology. With an astounding energy density of up to 500 watt-hours per kilogram, this battery achieves both high energy density and high safety standards simultaneously. To put this into perspective, a conventional lead-acid car battery offers about 50 watt-hours per kilogram, while a lithium-ion EV battery, like those in Tesla Model 3, can hold up to around 265 watt-hours per kilogram. KTL's new condensed battery boasts double the energy density of nearly anything else on the market, and more than double that of Tesla's standard batteries in the Model 3 and Model Y. This means that installing this battery in any vehicle could effectively double its range compared to most current electric vehicles. Dr. Robin Zeng, chairman of KTL, stated, We launched the condensed battery with an energy density of 500 dodonodos wench kardigis, a 70 or 80% increase over current NCM batteries. We are focused on the aviation applications for condensed batteries, and as production scales up, we can reduce the cost and use the battery in cars too. 2. How will KTEL's new condensed battery impact electric vehicles like Tesla's? As we've known so far, CATL is currently collaborating with partners on developing electric passenger aircraft, adhering to aviation-grade quality and safety standards. Additionally, a car-grade version of the condensed battery is expected to enter mass production this year. The introduction of KATL's new condensed battery technology could revolutionize the electric vehicle market, enabling EVs to achieve longer ranges, greater efficiency, and lighter weights compared to internal combustion engine vehicles. This weight reduction will enhance vehicle performance and lower production costs, making EVs more affordable. For instance, CATL's new battery is expected to double the range of current EVs while reducing battery weight, thus decreasing overall vehicle weight and improving efficiency. A 30 kilowatt hour battery pack could allow a Tesla Model 3 to achieve a range of 600 kilometers. If the battery's weight is reduced by 700 LB, the Tesla Model 3 would be lighter than comparable internal combustion engine vehicles, enhancing performance and reducing costs. Cattle's new condensed battery could soon enable luxury vehicles to achieve ranges between 1,500 and 2,000 kilometers. Dr. Robin Zung highlighted the broader implications, stating, You do not need to drive your car, and the car will make money for you but it requires longer cycle life for the batteries. To meet this demand, we have developed battery technology for a cycle life of 18,000 cycles. The launch of this advanced technology breaks the long-standing limitations of the battery industry, opening up new possibilities for electrification focused on high safety and lightweight designs. Comparing KTL's condensed battery to Tesla's 4680 battery, highlights the significant advancements in battery technology. KTL's condensed battery boasts an energy density of over 500 watt-hours per kilogram, which is double the industry average of around 250 watt-hours per kilogram, and more than twice the energy density of Tesla's standard batteries in the Model 3 and Model Y. In contrast, Tesla's 4680 battery has an energy density of approximately 300 watt-hours per kilogram, which, while impressive, still falls short of KTL's new offering. The larger cell design of the 4680 helps increase energy density compared to Tesla's previous designs, but does not match the breakthrough levels achieved by KTL. The technological advancements in KTL's condensed battery are remarkable. It uses a bio-based condensed state electrolyte with high conductivity, 
creating a self-adapting mesh structure at the micron level that adjusts the interaction forces between chains, thereby enhancing the battery's electrical conductivity and lithium-ion transport efficiency while improving the microstructure's stability. This battery also integrates ultra-high energy density cathode materials, improved anode materials, advanced separators, and optimized manufacturing processes, resulting in excellent charge and discharge performance and enhanced safety. Tesla's 4680 battery, on the other hand, features a tabless design that reduces internal resistance and improves thermal performance. The improved cathode and anode materials, including silicon in the anode and nickel cobalt aluminum (NCA) or nickel manganese cobalt (NMC) in the cathode, help increase energy density and reduce production costs. The larger cell structure also enhances heat dissipation and reduces the risk of overheating. When it comes to charging and discharging performance, KTEL's condensed battery stands out. It offers superior charging and discharging capabilities thanks to its advanced technologies and improved materials. This battery can support fast charging up to 550 kilowatts, a feature that is becoming increasingly common in China. In contrast, while Tesla's 4680 battery also supports fast charging due to its tabless design, it has not yet reached the 550 kilowatt level. Safety is another critical area where KTL's condensed battery excels. The improved microstructure stability reduces the risk of fire and explosion, and the flame retardant materials and self-adapting mesh structure enhance safety. Tesla's 4680 battery also focuses on safety with its larger cell design, which reduces the number of cells needed in the battery pack and thus lowers the risk of overheating and fire. The improved heat dissipation from the tabless design further enhances safety. In terms of production efficiency, CATL's advanced manufacturing processes increase efficiency and reduce costs, enabling large-scale production at lower costs. Tesla's 46 and 80 battery also benefits from a simpler and more efficient production process due to its tabless design and larger cell structure, which reduces production costs by approximately 14% compared to previous cells. Tesla's significant investment in automated production lines further boosts efficiency and reduces costs. In summary, KTL's condensed battery outperforms Tesla's 4680 battery in terms of energy density, charging and discharging performance, and safety. However, Tesla's 4680 battery has significant advantages in production efficiency and heat dissipation. Both batteries represent significant advancements in EV technology, promising substantial improvements for the industry. 3. What lies ahead for Tesla EVs with KTL's condensed battery? With an energy density of 500 watt-hours per kilogram, KTL's condensed battery is set to revolutionize not just electric vehicles, EVs, but also electric aviation. This remarkable energy density is a crucial milestone for making commercial electric aircraft feasible. KTL has already successfully tested a 4-ton electric passenger plane and plans to launch an 8-ton electric plane by 2027. The new battery technology also significantly reduces the risk of fire and explosion making EVs and electric aircraft much safer. Electric motors are simpler and more reliable than internal combustion engines, reducing the risk of mechanical failure and enhancing overall safety. Currently, CATL boasts the world's most comprehensive battery technology roadmap, demonstrating an exceptional ability to translate fundamental research into industrial applications and large-scale commercial use. For instance, in 2021, CATL introduced the first generation of sodium ion batteries with an energy density of 160 watt hours per kilogram, showcased at Sherry Automobiles exhibition. In 2022, CATL unveiled the Killin battery, the world's highest integration battery, which entered mass production in March this year and has been adopted by premium BEVs like Zika, Ito, and Lai Auto. Evenly, KTL is not stopping at 400 watt-hours per kilogram. The company aims to reach 500-600 watt-hours per kilogram by 2030, promising more efficient and cost-effective EVs, thus accelerating the green transportation revolution. 
These advancements will impact a wide range of vehicles, including large trucks and pickups, making them more viable with extended range and faster charging times. For instance, a large truck equipped with Key ATL's Keelan battery can achieve a range of 800 kilometers, and with the condensed battery, the range could extend to 1,400 kilometers. So, we guess you may wonder, how will this battery transform Tesla's lineup? The introduction of KTL's condensed battery will have a profound impact on Tesla's entire vehicle lineup. For the Model Y and Model 3, this battery could potentially double their range. For example, the Model 3, which currently has a range of about 358 miles, could see its range increase to over 700 miles. This would make long-distance travel much more practical and reduce the need for frequent charging stops. The higher energy density of the battery would also result in lighter battery packs, improving vehicle performance and efficiency. For Tesla's highly anticipated Cybertruck and Semi, the advantages are even more significant. The Cybertruck, built for heavy-duty use, would experience a major boost in both range and load-carrying capacity. The Tesla Semi, designed to revolutionize freight transport, could achieve a range of up to 1,400 kilometers, around 870 miles, with the new battery, drastically cutting down operational costs and charging times. The rumored Model 2, Tesla's upcoming affordable EV, would benefit greatly as well. With the condensed battery's lower cost and higher efficiency, Tesla could produce a high-performance vehicle at a lower price, making electric cars more accessible to a wider audience. Do you think this future will come true? Comment 1 if yes, comment 2 if no, and don't forget to share your reason. For those eagerly awaiting the future of electric vehicles, KTL's new condensed battery marks a monumental leap forward. With its unprecedented energy density exceeding 500 watt-hours per kilogram, this technology promises to revolutionize range and efficiency in EVs like never before. Will Tesla integrate these batteries into their lineup, pushing the boundaries of electric vehicle performance even further? What potential benefits do you see for electric vehicles with such advancements? How might these batteries impact your daily life? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, Adam Tech, for the latest updates on EV innovations and hit the bell icon to stay tuned.